Guys, I'm gonna show you how to make the easiest pizza at home with simple ingredients, okay? So, we're just gonna add our marinara sauce and spread that around our bread. And this is super funny, fun way to do it. And if you have picky eaters at home, this is perfect for you. So you have six pieces of bread. I have a family of six, so I'm gonna show you what we do. I have two vegetarians. I have two people who like Hawaiian. And I have two people who just like the standard pepperoni. So now we're gonna get our cheese, put it around. And you wanna spread everything kind of even. Of course, you're using mozzarella cheese. And this is called pizza toast. And it's super fun to do if you don't wanna use dough and you wanna make pizza, this is perfect. So the white bread replaces the pizza part, the dough of the pizza. And it's a great canvas for everything. So perfect, and then there you go. Add as much as you want, add as little as you want. And this is why it's called for picky eaters because people who like pineapple get some pineapple of course, because I'll have people who like pineapple pizza. I've never been a big fan of pineapple pizza, but a lot of people in my family do like pineapple pizza. And all we're gonna do is add some ham. Super fun, right? Super fun, super easy. Boom, boom, boom. Some ham right there, some pineapple right there. Perfect. Now, my regular normal Joe's, just like some pepperoni. So we're just gonna put some pepperoni slices on it. Boom, 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 boom. Super fast, super easy, right? So add a little bit more pepperoni so it gets nice and cooked. And then my other pieces of my family are vegetarian. So I have this vegetable mix. You can use peppers if you want but they really do like this carrot and pea mix on pizza. Trust me, trust me, it just works. Trust me, it looks weird at first, but just, just works. So that's the perfect amount of everything. And now we're just gonna go on seasoning. To really make it taste like pizza, all you need to do is add a little bit of basil. Just a little bit a little bit of oregano. And a little bit of garlic powder. And that's all you need. That is all you need for your seasonings. So garlic powder, basil, pesto, uh, and oregano. Now we're gonna to toss this in the oven and we're just gonna to toast everything up to be nice and crispy at 350 to 400 degrees, depending on how strong your oven is. Guys are done. Look at how pretty they are. Wow. Look how easy it was to make everything. So my wife loves Hawaiian. I don't like Hawaiian. I like regular pepperoni and cheese. That's what I go for. My daughter is vegetarian. Of so course. I got a veg veggie pizza. And it's super easy to make. Look at that. It is not soggy. It's crusty. It has some crust too. Okay. So what I like to do, and look how easy it is to pick it up, right? So we made basically pizza toast and that's what I love to call it. That is hot. I almost burned myself. But how I like to eat it, super simple, right? You get your own toast. Get your Parmesan cheese. Yeah. That's perfect. Ooh. Look at this crumb. Oh my God. <laughs> that just dissolved. Okay, and then all you do, I like to eat something spicy, right? So yeah. that's why this is awesome. Cause you know how pizza shops are? What is it? It's only half the pizza. Only half. They cannot go any more. They cannot go any less. So how do you eat this? If you're a New Yorker. Oh. What do we do? Oh, we, we fold the bad boy. We fold it. Yeah. Look at that. Crispy, toasty. Watch this. So good. So easy. Give it a try. This is the best thing to make if you have a picky family and you guys all want your own pizza.
Who said white bread isn't good? Mmm. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Oh, oh.